Good morning guys, Wayne here. Welcome to track three. So we're gonna head out to Yelverton today through the tunnel. See you in a minute. Okay, so this morning I've come over the train bridge. That's the road bridge where I was the other day. I'm gonna head back down that way again. Uh, through, through the salt tram and up the river. Well, I'm not gonna do so much video at this end. Wait till we get to the moors. See you in a minute. So we're uh, doing well for time. It's not even nine o'clock in the morning, and I'm already uh, halfway there. What I did was I took two of these bottles last night and I froze them, so they slowly melt throughout the day. But uh, I'm gonna carry on pushing forward. I've been in the jungle or something it's fabulous I've never been out here so early in the morning I mean it's not even nine o'clock in the morning and I've been riding since time did I start quarter past eight so yeah so this is where we were the other day but I'm not going to focus too much on this area okay so I've come along the track a bit further now and uh, I want to dedicate this bit to my good friend Snappy uh, that's our online username so I found some ruins for you my friend and uh, let's have a look at it so the path is uh, along there that's the main path that I'm going along and I've come down here and there's some ruins so I said to my friend you know she likes ruins and things like that, and archaeology. I thought, if I find anything interesting, I'll come down and have a look. I'm not sure what this is, but it looks like an old water wheel would have been in here. I could be wrong. I probably am wrong. But if you can imagine like a wheel in there, or maybe a bolt going through it, I'm thinking, I mean, that looks like an old stream. I'm thinking that was an old water wheel. Possibly. Um, which kind of makes sense with it having a train track. There would have been a house or a, maybe a small train yard or something at some point. So uh, it's, it's pretty big. But I just thought I'd uh, come and have a look at it. Oh well, my good friend. And if I see if anything else of interest, We'll check it out as well. So I just thought I'd show you this bridge. It's an old cast iron bridge that used to carry water down there and then it would follow down the stream. I just thought, wow, it's pretty amazing. Okay, so I think we're coming up to the tunnel now, soon starting to look a bit familiar I just met a really nice lady uh, with a little dog who sort of uh, has given me a bit more of an encouragement to go through the tunnel I appreciate that okay <laughs> moment of truth we could, we, could, we could kill the camera here if you wanted, but I know I've got to go through. Um, I promised everybody I would go through. I am a little bit nervous because it's been a good 30 years, but I'm going to go through. And uh, I'm, I just met a really nice, pretty lady who gave me a, a bit of encouragement. So um, let's do this. Oh, okay. Let's do this. Woohoo! We're going in. Oh, this looks mad. That's a good job we put a torch on the front of the bike. Wow. See, 30 years ago, I came through here with a very old friend on two BMXs. 
And like I said before, it crashed in the middle. You know? Lost our bikes. There was no lights back. And the walls were painted white. Wow, it's amazing. Oh look, well, there it is. There's tunnels all the way along the wall, to the left and the right, which are all bit, like bricked up or they've got like bars on them. And one of them is a tunnel. It goes for several miles underneath Dartmoor, you know, and comes out from the sand. That was wicked. So all the so, all you my subscribers and my new subscribers, I did it. We've done the tunnel. Yippee, I kind of want to go back now and do it again. Uh, that was awesome. I'm going to carry on going forward because I can't remember where this comes out. And the goal is to get to Yelverton today, up to the rock. So, you've got to give us a like now for going through because that's... Uh, that's the first time in 30 years at least I've been through there since my bad experience. Ah, oh, it feels good. It feels as like I've accomplished something. I did it. I went through the tunnel first time in 30 years or 29 years. 30 years. It's a long time. The tunnel's back that way. Um, I'm going to go that way which hopefully, if I remember right, should come out near Yelverton. I could be wrong, but Yelverton is where I'm heading. There's a, there's a place with a giant rock and there's, there's another track down there. So all in all, a good morning and a special hello to the lady who I saw with the dog. I'm sorry, I forgot your name already, but she's very pretty and very encouraging. So uh, I know she did subscribe, so I will check her channel out later and uh, it'd be nice to bump into her again one day, maybe. Who knows? But anyway, I'm going to carry on that way. I'll see you in a bit. Check this out, guys. Look, look, look. Oh, wow, there's babies. Look at that. Isn't that lovely. Hi, hey, buddy. Oh, wow, they're beautiful. So, like I said a few minutes ago, that's the river, the old stone river. It goes right the way across the moors. Okay, so yeah, this is um, this is the old railway. We're on the we're still on the old railway path. So you think that this would have been you know trains going along here, probably about hundred years ago. So we are on the way to Yelverton. Woohoo! I may even come back the same way. I'm not sure yet. We're heading deeper into Dartmoor. This really has been an amazing ride. I've met so much nice people and that. Everyone's really nice and friendly and positive. I'd love to meet that lady again with the dog. She was really nice. And apologise if you watch this back and I've forgotten your name, but. Oh, look, look at, the, look at the, this is the old path. Amazing. I've just seen 
some and I've got to get all the footage. I don't know if you guys can see, but there's babies over there. Little baby horses. <laughs> They're great. Oh, lovely. There's babies everywhere. There's cows. We usually have sometimes. You see donkeys up on the moors, so maybe we'll see some. What an amazing ride! So I'm going to keep pushing and keep going forward. Okay, so I've just come over that little bridge there. Now this, this is like a small river. Well, it's dried up now. These things have been here. This has been here for hundreds of years, you know. I don't know how long, but... Um, see, I'm 45 now. I mean, when I was a kid, these were never full of water. They were always empty. So this is from hundreds of years ago. I don't know if it's Roman, I'm not sure. But it, it just goes right the way across the moors for hundreds and hundreds of kilometers. Or miles so right now I'm heading up this path which I've been told is one of the old it's part of the old railway which is fantastic and I'm gonna carry on going to Yelverton which is about another two miles away and uh, we'll see what we can see up there well, I just feel great I've done the tunnel you know after 30 years I finally done the tunnel I'm uh, I'm even thinking of going back the same way, but I'm not sure yet. Okay, mission accomplished. I just wanted to show you this though. Much better history there. I know a good friend of mine like, loves all this kind of stuff. But we did it. I'm at Yelverton. And uh, there's a big rock here that everybody climbs and all that kind of stuff and there is the rock it's funny i thought it was slightly bigger than that but there could be a, a bit more behind it but that is mainly the rock and uh further down the road is yelverton little village and shops and all that kind of stuff so i've done it so it's it's over 10 miles i've probably done about 12 miles today according to the bikers i had a chat with earlier I also want to give a shout out to Evans Cycles. I will leave a link to their website in the description for uh, giving me an amazing bike. I'm really enjoying the bike. It's brilliant. It's probably one of the best bikes I've ever had. And a special thanks to my big brother for buying it for me. Um, so now, <laughs> it's time to go back. So if it's 12 miles here and it's 12 miles back, yeah, it's a long day. Um, it's just gone 11 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to have a cold drink now. And it's been, it's been a gas. It's, it's been great. And I met a beautiful lady on the way. So I, I'd like to bump into her again. But, um, and I did the tunnel. I did the tunnel. So I'm looking forward now. to. I'm actually looking forward to going back the same way and going back through the tunnel. And if you'd like... I'll video that bit as well. But um, what a fabulous morning. So if I can keep these rides coming, I'd like to do them at least once a week, if not every two weeks. Um, but I've done three now in basically, it's about, it's about eight days altogether. And it's been fabulous. So give it a like on this video. Thanks for all the new supporters. Thanks to all the new subscribers. And uh, we'll see you again on the next one. This is where I'm hoping to camp one day. To pitch a tent up somewhere, stay the night, do a box opening, travel home in the morning. See you on the next one. Bye for now. <laughs>